Hello everyone, Justin here again. So today I'm going to show you how to add your menu. <coughs> Let's say you are running an FMB business or even chiropractor, chiropractic service or even clinic, right? You can definitely, you should definitely add a menu or a product in your Google Business Profile. So how do you do that? Is that just same? Just go to Google and type in my business. I should be able to see what are the your your business here if you have claim or created one profile right so click on view profile and from here if you are a restaurant service or a coffee shop there are actually a edit menu item here and if you are not you would be you would not be able to see this and you should only be able to see edit profile edit product sorry so from here i'll suggest you to go and add each and every product you have in your menu into your Google Business Profile. So what you can do here is that if you have not added anything, you should only be able to see Add Menu section and Add Menu item here, right? So first of all, Add Menu section, let's say for example, we have branch here, right? So you should just add branch and whenever, why do you want to add this is because um, whenever people search for branch, in KL or in TVVI or near me and whatever keywords they have, right? Um, it should definitely match what the section is actually about. All right. Because you 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 want people to actually search for brunch, breakfast, dinners, lunch, whatever keyword it is, right? So you can actually rank better on Google with your Google business profile. So from here, it's actually pretty interesting because um you should add things like breakfast and of course try your best to search whatever it is uh, here right because it really matches what are the things that um, people are actually looking for let's say for example this is okay big breakfast right this, if it's not no worries on that because you know your clients better than google right let's say it's breakfast your price let's say it's 12 ringgit and of course you want to add in all the description of your product as well let's say for example we have like beef bacon brown right sausages and whatnot just be as precise as possible on what is actually being added so and of course you have vegetarian and vegan options as well you can add a photo I'll definitely suggest that the reason being um the reason being Google is able not able to identify very clearly on what photos to show, right? So let me show an example here. So okay, let's come back to here first. So once you have added everything, just click save. So I wouldn't be added I won't be adding this because they have a breakfast menu already. I wouldn't be it would be a little bit confusing for Google and myself as well. So I'll just click back. All right. So what it does is that it will show what do I mean by this description as detailed as possible, right? So this is what they have in their menu and we have actually added each and everything. So Whenever people search for big breakfast, of course, uh, it would definitely show on Google. And people searching for big breakfast with beef bacon, right? This product would show as, uh, I would say, higher than whatever competitors that are in the market, right? So you would definitely, you you should definitely have, uh, very detailed information in the description. Right. If you feel that you don't have the time, of course you can choose to not add everything, right? Because uh it's it just speaks itself. And of course, if you have added the vegetarian or vegan option, it would appear here as well. So whenever people search for things like like bites, vegetarian like bites, this one, this few products would um be appearing as higher as compared to what others are offering, right? Of course, not only for not only for Google, it is actually very important for you to show your customers what you are actually offering. 
All right. Of course, going for products as well is actually very similar to what menu has to offer. However, you are able to add products in subcategories. So what it does is that it would show not only the product itself in picture form whenever people search on desktop. So yeah, it's much easier for people to know like what you're offering, right? And it's more attractive as well. And as you can see here, each and every category we would definitely show here as well. Let's say, for example, you have coffee, you have tea, you have brunch, right? So each and everything would definitely show here. And whenever people search for things like uh, coffee, coffee shops, coffee near me, right? Um, you should be able to rank a little bit higher as compared to your competitors who have not done anything at all, right? So, yep. This is how you should actually add your menu and your product on Google Business Profile. And hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you very much. See you next time.